In this first tutorial of the Rhino Parametrics plugin, we are going to investigate the various elements of the user interface. When the Rhino plugin is loaded, you can see a new Rhino Parametrics menu, a new toolbar, and a tree view where all Parametrics objects will be aggregated. In the new Rhino Parametrics menu, we can show or hide the interface, show or hide the toolbar, show the project preferences and the Rhino Parametrics help. The new toolbar allows you to show or hide the tree view, to show project preferences or to show the Rhino Parametrics help. In the creation of a new parametric project, three default construction planes are already present. One construction plane by main direction, right, face and top. Let's investigate some project preferences. We shall not detail all project preferences. These preferences will be mentioned in different tutorials. A preference which can be interesting at the beginning of a project is C-plane display size. Here we have a display size of 2. We can increase it. As the result, the C-plane size gets bigger. If you work with small or big projects, it can be interesting to set this value. Other preferences can be used with their default value. Rhino Parametrics preferences are saved in the project. It is thus necessary to reconfigure these preferences at the start of each new project.